Oh my god. What is happening? Okay. Who was that? Was that a lady being carried? Bunch of people back here? Alright, buddy. Go your own way. Lotus Blossom? No. No? What was that? I don't know what that was. So, it's a nice night out, huh? It's alright, but what where did the people go? Oh. Ming Zhao says look for Wang Ho at the Red Dragon restaurant. Where was he? We were just there, but we didn't see anything. We need a password here. Zhao's Imports. Yeah, this is kind of like outside Chinatown, I guess. I'm gonna have a look later, but I'm just wondering where the people who were carrying away the unconscious person went to? Golden Ocean's Fish Market? What? Okay, well that was... I'm not sure we were supposed to be able to chase them down, because I certainly don't see anybody so far. Hmm. Maybe I gotta look a little bit more carefully. Oh my god. My god. Okay. Walk away. Walk away. <laughs> Completely forgot that was a thing. We saw it one time back in Santa Monica, in the very beginning. <laughs> This does not go anywhere. It's just kind of like a little... little railing. What about down here? Locked. Sewers. Oh, there's so many locked doors here. But this seems like the same place. It's got the same music going on inside. me alone. Sorry. Was this? Am I allowed here? This is a combat area. Am I allowed to be seen? I don't know. Well, I'm kind of scared. I don't want to... Hello? Okay, okay. Are they gonna still be mad at me if I go back in? What is this place though? It's kinda... I don't wanna mess anything up. Yes? Okay, but they don't get angry again. Okay, I'll... Um, hmm. Oh my god! <gasps> oh no! No, Lynn! We're in the noodle shop! This is the ramen shop! Oh no! Oh no! Got eyes! Oh! Oh! Okay. What about that door? Excuse me? What have you been up to tonight, Tyler? Ten. Okay, I'll just go now. Maybe I'll be back later then. I can't do ten. <coughs> These guys... Oh no! Oh my god. I thought that was some kind of a story though. Lynn's story? More like a little urban legend? But... Well, whoever that was. I don't know who it was, but... Somebody was in the back there, and we did get their eyes. Wait, so this is a noodle shop? What? But that's the ramen shop right here! It says it's a ramen shop! Yeah, it was on the, the bus stop earlier. I'll scream. Cheeky Mei Mei Ramen 4! Yeah. Buy a watch. What the heck? 
Well, ramen is Japanese, so maybe noodle shop? They were trying to say Chinese noodle shop? I don't even know. But I, uh, I got your- I got your eyes. If you were still looking for that. We should look at it. We did already. All it said was eyes. Ew! Ew! You are always welcome here. <gasps> what if that's related to why he has different colored eyes? Oh my god. Here are the eyes. Mm. Yes. They stare ambitiously. Hello, Lin. Do you like it there? These are an excellent addition to my shop. Here, please accept this as a fair trade. I have another task. If it piques your curiosity. Did he actually give me something? Or did he just give me two experience points? <laughs> Here, here's something for your fair trade. Ooh, Heart of Eliza. Whatever that is. Hmm, let's hear it. I need you to be a bad luck farmer. Do you know what this is? <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a poor translation, all right. I'm gonna guess a person that sucks in other people's bad luck so that the person they suck it from can have good luck or at least be neutral and not be plagued by unfortunate things? No, why don't you tell me? A customer has bought an unlucky talisman from me and wishes it delivered to an enemy of theirs. I need you to place this in the locker of a patron at the Lotus Blossom Massage Parlor so that the bad luck can bloom. Oh, it's a massage parlor. That's all? Okay, I'll do it. My customer has placed a black circle on his enemy's locker. <laughs> Plant to talisman. Bad luck, farmer. <laughs> <laughs> Your customer placed a black circle, but for some reason can't put the talisman in himself. Okay, great. Sure, whatever. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Okay, but I can't get in. Can I even get in? I thought we just went over there and there was a lock on the door. Maybe through another way. If we're looking at the main quest though, we should probably be trying to find Mr. Wong Ho. I feel like we didn't see anybody when we were here, but maybe now things have changed. Unless if Wong Ho was that drunk guy. Was there something else? I'm here to see Wong Ho. Second floor, have a good night. Goodbye. There was a second floor? Oh! Whoa! Oh, wow, that's so... This is so space-conserving. Hello? Hey, baby. No, I'm still at work. I don't know. Why would I want to rush home right away? Yeah, I do like that. <laughs> what else? With a what? <laughs> You're in the kitchen. Yeah, they were on sale, so I bought some. You did too, like zucchini. Am I interrupting? It's an Elysium here. Oh. They took her. They took her. Who did they take? Oh, the cutscene we saw. Kiki, my daughter. They grabbed her. They called and said, Wong Ho has meddled with Tong for the last time. Hey, wasn't Tong the people that we stole the um, briefcase from? It was the Russian Mafia and the Tong. <laughs> Just saying it like that makes it so... There's a lot of stereotypes in this game. Oh, the Russian Mafia. You know, Fat Larry with a truck and, and now the Chinese people here. <laughs> anyway. Uh, this might not be the best time, but Ming Zhao sent me to talk with you. Ming Zhao? Oh, of course. Please forgive me, but as you can see, I am in a most terrible situation. I am Wang Ho, owner of the Red Dragon. Again, I apologize for my inconsiderate behavior. No, no, no! Your, your daughter's being kidnapped! You shouldn't have to apologize to me for anything! That's way bigger. Uh, no problem. What's going on here, Wang Ho? The Tong. 
a local street gang here in Chinatown just broke into my restaurant and kidnapped my daughter at gunpoint. The Tong grow more bold every day, and now they have my Kiki. Wait, was that the guy that we saw at the lounge? The guy that we were like, hey Tong, are you lonely tonight? And Tong might not be his name, it might be the gang name. What? That makes Mama angry? What the hell? <laughs> Why would the Tong want your daughter? I am a man of some prominence here in Chinatown. I have many allies, but there are also many who would like to see my demise. The Tong have chosen the coward's path, using my daughter as leverage against me. Leverage for what? I do not know. I will undoubtedly hear from the Tong very shortly. They will have demands, and then perhaps we will know more. Do you know where they took your daughter? No. The Tong have many... Uh, wait. Please excuse me a moment. Hello. Zhao. Huh? Yes. How did you... Of course. I see. Thank you, my friend. Your debt has been repaid a thousand times over. Yes. Of course. Goodbye. That didn't sound like the Tong. That was... someone who owed me an old debt. It has been repaid. I know where the Tong are keeping my daughter. That was probably the Zhao of Zhao's imports. Um, hmm... Good news. Now I need your help in resolving another matter. Am I gonna help him? Good. Well, the first one is saying we should go kill the Tongs. But if he knows where the Tongs and the daughter is, there's no reason I gotta help, right? Unless if you're saying, no, for some specific reason, I need you to help me. Good news. Now I need your help in resolving another matter. Again, I am sorry. But until Kiki is returned, I cannot help you. Well, you already know where she is. <sighs> Fine, I'll go squish those tong bugs. Where the hell is she? Kiki is being held at the Lotus Blossom. What? A massage parlor here in Chinatown. If you bring her back to me, I will help you in any way that I can. Great. Another thing in the Lotus Blossom. Of course, I'll bring her back safely. Thank you. I shall wait here until you return. Strike fast. The Tong will not be expecting anyone so soon. Good luck, my friend. See ya. Did you give me a key card? Because I can't get into... Oh, Heart of Eliza. This glassy stone appears to have a liquid core. The stone itself is milky translucent, rock solid. And unlike anything you've seen, possession of the Heart of Eliza conveys a melee bonus of one. Oh. Weird. Bad luck talisman. A talisman that Mr. Ox asked you to put in a marked locker at the Lotus Blossom. Yeah, a bad luck talisman? Okay. The little text there at the bottom says confusion in both Chinese and Japanese. Hmm. Huh. But did you give me a key though? Because I'm pretty sure I couldn't get into the place. Where's my key ring holder? No, it's not here, but um, hmm. Maybe I was wrong. I'll go back and have a look. Who was a lady speaking here? The hostess. Oh. People gonna be mad at me if I... Hopefully not. Throwing star. When you wish upon a throwing star, you wish you had the skill to use a bloody thing. <laughs> we can't use it. Was that hostess not on this floor? What was that? Yup, yup, go down, go down. What a sneaky little elevator though. I like it. It's so discreet. 
Yeah, this guy here. Are you a tong? A tong? Is that a tong jacket? Yeah? No, sorry, mistook you for someone else. This guy seems important though, because he's got a scar. He's got a unique face. Sorry, Lu Fang no speak English when he drunk. So we gotta get this guy not drunk again? Hmm. Okay, all right. Feels like we've seen most of the big things around here already. Mm hmm. This place sells glasses. This place sells watches. Oh, Huntley. Huntley watches. Have we been here? Yeah, this is the place where we found the eyeballs. And then over here. Oh, now we can go in. But it's gotta be sneaky. We gotta put the talisman here and find Kiki. Oh. Hi? Can I... can I have a massage session here? Rats! Oh, I mean rats! Rats! Rocky. A lot of Japanese snacks. Am I allowed to walk in here? Because you're not really paying attention to me. Hold on, hold on. Kiki is in the Lotus Blossom. And there's also a locker somewhere in here where we can put the talisman in. Ten. Oh, we can see the stairs. Ten is usually an indication that it's some story-related thing, right? So I'll just leave it alone. They put it at ten, so they don't want you to accidentally unlock it. Whoa! I don't know if I'm allowed to be seen or not. What are these rooms? They don't look like massage parlors. Nor locker rooms. I think I'm allowed to be here, right? No speak English. Sure. Oh, are you- are you for me? Somebody might walk in though. Oh, there's my new jacket. Oh, someone is looking for me. Aren't they? Sounded like they were. The women don't care. Oh, this is the massage places. There's no one being massaged right now. Sorry. Excuse me? Someone just said, did you hear that? In Cantonese in the back. So I think, yeah, they are chasing me, aren't they? I'm not supposed to be here, but for some reason, the women don't really care about me. I don't know if I should be sneaking or not, because I feel like I should. So many rooms here. Nope. This floor is probably restricted. Yeah, that guy heard me. What?
I don't know where I'm trying to go. Oh, no! Oh, this is probably where she's being kept. Is that... Is that Kiki? Yeah, they're, they're doing some filming work here. Probably of the non-consensual kind. Before checking that place out, I'm gonna try to find the locker first, because that's a main quest, right? So I want to make sure I get the thing, just in case. I don't think we can go much further, though. Yeah. Actually, I thought we would be able to get in via breaking down the door or something, but looking at it like this, doesn't even seem like that's the case. Does that mean we gotta... Oh. Actually. Well, they never said I had to do this stealthily. They never said that. But how can I put something, putting a talisman in a um, place and not doing it stealthily? Wouldn't that kind of break the whole concept? Some tapes here. Yeah, you he heard me again. Should we just kill them then? Because we can't get past here without killing them. Where do they find these people? Their Cantonese is horrible. Hey, where'd they go? We have to, right? Because those guys won't move and we... Wait. Hey. Fine! Is everybody gonna come here? I hope I didn't mess up by going all out here. But if we went down the corridor, then they would have seen me anyway. I didn't see a way to get past this. Okay. Yeah, this place is not just a massage place, is it? I don't think so. You're not Kiki! Excuse me? No. I thought you were Kiki! Why did I do all that? I thought they were guarding you. Money. Yay. Yeah, I thought they were like guarding Kiki because she's being held hostage here, but that was just a random lady. What? Do, do I still have to sneak? I feel like it's a bit of a moot point now. Padlock key. For this? Was this? How deep can we go? Look, I just want to find the lockers. That's all. Hey, who's there? It's a bath? Sorry. No bats allowed. Oh! Whoops. Apparently that wasn't... I guess that guy was here for a bath. That was a normal guy. That wasn't... a kidnapper. Whoops! Whoopsie daisy. Here we go. That guy? That guy spoke Mandarin and Cantonese. Hey! What the hell you think you're doing? That's my locker, hooker! Oh, obviously, there's been a misunderstanding. I thought it was mine. Apologies. No misunderstanding. I saw you. What the hell did you put in my locker? You know who I am, huh? You wanna die, hooker? 
Calm down, it's nothing. It's a simple mistake. I apologize, alright? Time to teach you a lesson about respecting people's property. Oh yeah, Hoka, you in for it now! Now wait a second. Really? Wait, that kind of defeats the whole point of putting in a bad luck talisman then, because they're dead entirely. Whoops. Whoops. What? You have dealt with a patron because he caught you placing the talisman for Mr. Rocks. You should return to him now. Why did he even catch me though? I wasn't making any noise. I didn't kill anybody in the bath. What? Come on, man. That's... That's not how it should have turned out. <laughs> we killed multiple patrons today. No, we don't want to go outside. We want to go back and rescue Kiki. Oh, I can't even get the talisman back. Well, I guess the whole point of giving him the talisman was to make sure that he would not have a good life. And now we kind of made sure of that anyway, so is that alright? I hope so. As I was saying, that guy in the bath. At first he spoke Cantonese, and then he said, I don't speak English and Mandarin. Both pretty poorly. <laughs> oh, this is the beginning. Okay. So now we go back to... here? <laughs> what kind of a... what kind of a way to... Hey! You bitch! I can't... I can't breathe in here! Your eyes? Oh, They're differently colored. Are you like a robot? What? Uh, yeah. That's why I'm letting you out. What? Yeah, who are you? You're not with the tongue. No, I'm not with the tongue. Didn't I just say that? You may not be with the tongue, but you seem to be as smart as they are. Do you want to be rescued or not? Man, the mouth on you. Are you Wong Ho's kid? Yeah, I'm Kiki. Who the hell are you? The Tong Welcoming Committee? Your old man sent me to bust your ass out of here. Oh, I'm so impressed. What? Like you want me to thank you or something? In your dreams, bitch. Say that after the person rescues you. Because at this point, you're still stuck. Keep talking like that and I'll keep your ass in the closet. Okay, okay. Man, you don't have to get all sensitive. I'm sorry, okay? Hey, everybody can vouch for me. I'm usually nice. You're just pissing me off here. That's better. Let's go. Yeah. Lord. I thought people might be coming to stop us, but, uh, maybe not? Okay. Oh, I think they are. They are coming. That's okay. Stay behind me. Here we go. Oh! This woman is used to it. She's not phased at all. She might be used to seeing the Mafia. Hi, I'm just gonna be leaving now, thank you. I don't know why that guy didn't care at all. That was weird. <laughs> Kiki? Kiki? You have rescued Kiki, though you feel like killing her instead. You should go back to Wang Ho and collect on his offer of help. Okay! Good. And also, the eyeball guy. Dude, I'm really sorry, man, but I accidentally... <laughs> I killed multiple patrons in the... the massage parlor. You are always welcome here. Really? Uh, how about that talisman? <sighs> Did the seed take root? The guy saw me. He attacked me, and... I killed him. <laughs> ah, hmm. That is assuredly bad luck for him. The cost to my customer was quite high. They will be pleased to hear this. As before, accept this with my gratitude. Oh, he's happy about it. You knew this was going to happen? 
<laughs> if you can't make a man walk into hell, make the demons come to him. Whoa, this guy. <laughs> this guy. Huh. I don't know what you are, old man, but I'll let you live for now. Goodbye. You scare me. You are always welcome here. Any more weird quests? Yes. Okay. Goodbye for now. Goodbye for now. Although I'm on to you. You're weird. And I don't know what kind of customers you have. But you're scaring me. We could directly go back to Wong Ho's, but I was thinking since we put off going back to the apartment earlier... <laughs> He's happy. Should I go back to Hollywood? Or, uh, downtown really quickly? Just, uh... Downtown? No. Yeah, Hollywood quests, but going back to downtown. Putting in the stuff in the mailbox and... Seeing new instructions from Mitnick. Yeah? We will be back very shortly. And we go back. Oh, we've been coming back here a lot recently. At least we don't have to go back to Santa Monica. That place was like a real dump. Master? Hey, Heather. Do you need new glasses? Are you wearing contacts right now? I can help pay some of those bills. Cause uh, walking around without your eyes seeing properly, that's, that's no good, okay? Oh, is that Vivi? Oh, that might be one of the rewards that we got from Gary Golden, but I, I wasn't always there, was it? I don't think so. Two unread email. Final network hub. Oh, damn it, there's one more. Okay, this is the big one. Quajin front to Chinatown called Kamikaze Zen. Yeah, I know it's Japanese. Don't ask. They've got a heavy duty security system. Recon's coming. One Shirin. Find the server room and activate the hub. One more thing. They have a vault where they keep software, etc. You better break into it and take something. Put them off the scent. This one can be messy. It's your ass. Okay, we have to steal something on purpose, just, uh, distract them. The key to the front door is in your mailbox. Our inside man put a file called Hooligan on one of the office terminals. It's a virus. Find it and execute it. This will shut down the power and allow you to get past the first real security door. I never got any blueprints to the inner sanctum, so once you're past the first door, you're on your own to find the server room and the vault. Good luck. Kamikaze Zen. Okay, sounds good to me. Was that it? Gary hasn't sent me a new email yet because he hasn't registered that I've given it to him already. Yeah. Same as usual. I'll be back. You should go to sleep, by the way, Heather. It's really late at night right now. I might be a vampire, but you're not. You can sleep now and then go out in the morning. You can do that, you know? I'm not keeping you here because I want to. You can walk outside if you want. Why do I keep going to the wrong floor? I couldn't even ask for her blood, though. Probably because she hasn't gotten back enough blood yet. Oh, this is still here. Kamikaze Zen access card. Thank you. Hey, Andrea. What? No, he's not. No, he's not. No, he is not. Uh, hold on, Andrea. I've got another call. Hey, Serena. Did you hear about Joe? And yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. I know. I was just on the phone with Andrea, and I was all, no, he's not. Yes, he is. Where even is that coming from? That wasn't you, right? Hey, you're here already. Oh, I'm so impressed. What? Like you want me to thank you or something? 
In your dreams, bitch. You are so rude. You sound exactly like that woman, but you're not her, right? Because it said hostess. Don't you have something else to say? Just forget that I saved you. Where are your manners? She's probably pretty damn spoiled, is what she is. Ah, welcome, my friend. I owe you a debt of gratitude. You have returned to me my greatest treasure. Kiki told me how you rescued her. You are a woman of great courage and honor. Thank you. Of course. Did you ever find out why the Tong took her? No. I have not been able to find out why they took Kiki. But I fear that it goes much deeper than the Tong. What do you mean? For a long time, I have been trying to clean up Chinatown. It was a difficult job, but the community came together, and we started to take back our streets from criminals like the Tong. Businesses reopened. Families moved back into their homes. Oh, okay. So as opposed to it being like a faction dispute, you're trying to tell me that you're the good guy, and the Tongs are the bad guys. Well, no, you own a legitimate business, but the Tongs are like criminals, is what you're saying. They're a street gang. What happened? The Tong looks stronger than ever. <laughs> Not really. Yes. I thought that the Tong were almost gone, but then something happened. Their numbers began to grow, and suddenly they had a lot of money to buy weapons. With them followed the drugs and the violence. It is almost worse now than before. Sounds like someone's helping them. Someone must be pulling their strings. I do not know, but there is a change in the air. I meditate, but my spirit is restless. The words of the I Ching are dark and unclear. Everything seemed to change as soon as... Uh. As soon as the sarcophagus came? Another mentioned that something is changing tonight or in the recent weeks. What? As soon as... What? I am sorry. I have said too much. Come on, you can trust me, Wang Ho. Well, things seemed to change as soon as Ming Xiao arrived and reopened the Temple of Golden Virtue. That was three years ago. I do not three mean years to ago. insinuate that she has anything to do with the resurgence of the Tong. The two events merely seem to coincide. Are you too scared to talk crap about her? Because she's so powerful? You don't have to be. I'm not on her side. Three years ago, though. That's a little bit... Okay, I thought it was like sarcophagus business, but that sarcophagus has only been in the area for like a week. Hmm. Interesting. Some people say there are no coincidences, Wang Ho. No. I will hear no more of it. Ming Zhao has been my trusted advisor ever since she arrived. I trust her completely. Completely? Completely enough to tell me what you just said? <sighs> okay, well, okay, okay. Let's talk about the information I need from you. Of course. What can I help you with? I'm looking for someone who's gone missing in Chinatown. Who is this person? Um, he's an old friend of mine named Barabbas. Hmm. What else can you tell me about him? He's ugly. D he's a real night owl, kind of pasty, withdrawn. I guess appearance-wise, maybe that's the best thing to get out of the way first, because that's the first thing you'll see about somebody. I see. I do not think I could find him for you, but I know someone who could. Yeah? Who? His name is Zhao. He is the man who called me and told me where Kiki was being held. Zhao has many connections. He owns an import-export warehouse in Chinatown. Go and see him there. I will call ahead and tell him to expect you. Hmm, thanks Wang Ho, I appreciate it. But I also want to ask you about more. Yes. How can I help you? I know you're a busy man. I have a few questions for you about Chinatown. What? 
would you like to know? Tell me about the Temple of Golden Virtue. The Temple of Golden Virtue has been here in Chinatown for a long, long time. Even before I was born. For many years it was old and forgotten, but Ming Zhao bought it and restored it to its former glory. Even though it seemed like a singular room and not really like a virtuous golden temple? Hmm, really, why did you do that? Ming Zhao holds our culture and our traditions in very high regard. The temple is a symbol of our strength as a people. It brings hope to the community. Really? Have you ever actually been inside? No. Ming Zhao receives her visitors in an antechamber, but no one is allowed to enter the temple itself. She tells me that it is a holy place and that it needs to be left undisturbed. Oh, so that's where we saw her, the antechamber, but not the actual very grand temple, I'm sure. Hmm. Yeah, that does sound really suspicious. Convenient answer. Maybe she's hiding something in there. I'm thinking that, but should I tell him that? Because he's very like, no, no, Ming Zhao is a very good person. Well, let's do it anyway. Convenient answer. Maybe she's hiding something in there. I will not hear such a thing. Ming Zhao has done much for my people, and I will not have you casting dispersion against her character. Yeah, don't say anything like that again. He's not gonna accept it. Mm. Fine, fine. I have a few more questions about Chinatown. What would you like to know? Mm, where does a girl get a gun around here? Guns? No. Even if I did know such things, I would not tell you where to get them. We have enough problems without telling people where to buy guns. I'm sorry. Is this guy like a really legit business owner? Not really part of the mafia or the triads or anything? <sighs> Trust me, I just want to know so I can avoid the place. I do not know for sure, but... I hear that Singh sells weapons out of his herbal remedy shop. Well, that was easy. <laughs> huh. A few other questions. Yes. How can I help you? None for now. See you later. By the way, teach your daughter some manners, please. She needs it. Oh, I'm so impressed. Okay, that's enough. Whatever. I can't believe we saved her. She's so ungrateful. Does a dad how does a dad feel about that though? She's acting like that in front of a stranger, the person who saved her, but she's not grateful at all. If I were the parent, I would feel kinda bad about how badly I raised her. Yeesh.